Well, how's it going everybody and welcome to another episode of Tyler's Real Fishing. This episode is part of the series called Do Bass Eat This? Now if you guys are new here, kind of what this series entails is I take a look underwater to see if bass actually eat the lures and sometimes the live bait that we as anglers throw on our lines. Now today's episode brings some awesome underwater footage that I'm super excited to share with you guys. And the topic that we're going to be discovering today, and kind of I wouldn't say discovering but researching, is do bass actually eat minnows? So in order to test whether or not bass eat live minnows, we need what they call in the scientific method or the scientific research circle called a control group. Now what a control group is, is, is a group that you don't change in an experiment. And so we are going to test a drop shot, which is a small shad imitation that's going to look very similar to the live minnow to kind of see if there's a difference between those two. So first thing, we're going to drop the drop shot down there on the fish to see if the fish reacts differently to the drop shot versus the live minnow. And then if the fish does decide to eat one better than the other, we're, gonna, we're kind of going to critique how the fish eats that in order to help you guys catch more fish. So let's head underwater. So with this first fish, we drop in the drop shot. Now the drop shot bait that I'm using is made by Beast Coast Fishing, and it's one of the best drop shot baits that I've ever used, caught tons of fish on it and definitely closely resembles the live minnow that you will see here in a second. Now, if you can't spot the bass, he's actually sitting kind of in the back right side of your screen, right by the trees there. So we see the artificial minnow is dropped in the area, so let's continue to observe what happens. So as you can see, the bass really doesn't show any interest in the soft plastic at all. You know, repeatedly the artificial minnow is presented in front of the fish and he does not eat it. So now I took the same setup and switched up the soft plastic out for the live minnow, and this was my first cast. Now that's pretty crazy, let's take a slow motion replay look at what happened there. It seems like the fish immediately noticed the lifelike action of the live minnow and even though his mind isn't focused on eating during this time of the year, he couldn't resist a tasty treat right in front of his face. Now with the second fish here, he's kind of hanging off the right side of your screen there. And again, I throw the drop shot minnow down there and he just doesn't seem to want anything to do with it. In fact, he just swims away when it drops in there. Now, as soon as I switch out the soft plastic minnow for the live minnow, boom, that fish eats it. It is in a split second that fish realizes, let's take a quick instant replay look at that. The fish realizes that that is a real minnow, not an artificial one. The tail action, the body action looks legit and boom, I catch that fish. And so definitely cool to see kind of the difference between those two types of lures. And we got one more little example. I didn't throw the artificial lure on this one. I just went straight to the live minnow cast it down there and just again in a split second that fish turns around sees the action of the fish and eats it and in this instance i just kind of let him sit there for a minute just to see if he would spit it out and he didn't <laughs> and so oftentimes when i'm throwing you know an artificial soft plastic lure they'll as in the as in the worm if you've seen the live worm video the fish eats it and spits it right out but with this one i kind of gave him a second as you'll see in the replay here to eat it and that fish slurped it in probably content, had it in his mouth and said, you know what, I'm going to eat this thing. <laughs> so even though the fish wasn't fully focused on feeding, it was cool to see that he would keep it in his mouth for a long period of time. So to conclude, I think that yes, of course bass eat minnows. In most of the country, a shad is a bass's main source of food, but it was interesting to see how the action of the soft plastic really matters when imitating a live minnow. You know, even my favorite soft plastic drop shot lure, the Beast Coast Magic Flick, can't always fool a bass from the real thing, the live minnow. So that is it for the video this time, everybody. Hopefully you enjoyed, and of course, 
As I love to do on Tyler's Real Fishing, I love to teach you guys something, so I hope that you learned something from kind of watching how these bass react to the lures and the live minnows underwater. And of course, if you guys haven't subscribed to the channel yet, make sure you guys hit the subscribe button and the notification bell as well. And uh, be on the lookout. We got some awesome underwater footage coming in the next few weeks, as, long as, as well as tournament videos, vlogs, and some super cool summer travel content. We'll see you guys next time on Tyler's Real Fishing.